डियर स्टूडेंट्स असलम इट इज़ माई हम्बर रिक्वेस्ट टू ऑल स्टूडेंट्स फ्रेंड्स एंड व्यूवर्स प्लीज़ सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे द लेक्चर इज एफ एस सी मैथमेटिक्स पार्ट टू यूनिट नंबर टू डिफ्रेंसीशन एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट फोर द लास्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव एंड द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ क्वेश्चन नंबर फाइव इज डिफ्रेंशिएट वन प्लस एक्स केयर होल की पावर एंड विद रिस्पेक्ट टू एक्स केयर बोथ फंक्शंस आर इंडिपेंडेंट फंक्शंस फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट फर्स्ट फंक्शन इज वाई इक्वल टू वन प्लस एक्स केयर होल की पावर एन एंड दिस विल बी टेकन एज इक्वेशन वन एंड सेकेंड लेट u equal to x square and this will be taken as equation टू now we find now we find dy over du here in equation वन the variable y is dependent variable and x is independent variable here in 2 the variable u is dependent variable and x is independent variable here we use three variable y x and u and this function is composition function and when we uh, find the derivative of composition function we deal with chain rule first of all we find the derivative of first we apply dy over dx both side dy over dx is equal to d over dx into 1 plus x square whole ki power n this term is same dy over du sorry dy over dx equal to when the derivative apply on this function first of all power will become on first n into 1 plus x square and 1 power is less here n minus 1 then the derivative apply on base and base is 1 plus x square d over dx into 1 plus x square okay dy over dx equal to n into 1 plus x square whole ki power n minus 1 when the derivative apply on 1 1 is a constant term and answer is 0 plus when derivative apply on x square here we use power rule 2 will become on start and 1 power is less 2 minus 1 1 1 is a understood okay and uh, here base is x and the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 so final answer is dy over dx equal to multiply 2x by this term 2 nx into 1 plus x sol ki power n minus 1 now we take the derivative of second the dependent variable with respect to independent variable du over dx equal to d over dx we take derivative of both side x square here we use power rule when derivative of lie on this function we use power rule power will become on start and one power is less 2 minus 1 1 1 is a understood power and then the derivative of uh, and then we take the derivative of base and base is x the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 and final answer is 2x okay now we use chain rule by chain rule the statement of chain rule is dy over du equal to dy over dx multiplied by dx over du and next step is dy over du equal to now we put the value of dy over dx here the value of dy over dx is 2 nx into 1 plus x whole ki power n minus 1 we put the value of this here 2 nx into 1 plus x square 
sorry 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 here the term is x square x square whole key power n minus 1 okay multiplied by the value of dx over du here the value of du over dx is equal to 2x in denominator understood the value of 1 so we take reciprocal then we use the value of d over dx over du here value is 2x and uh, 2x will be cancel out with 2x and final answer is dy over du equal to 2n into 1 plus x square whole t power n minus 1 and this is a final answer okay note it now this is a fourth part of question 5 statement is differentiate ax plus b over cx plus d with respect to ax square plus b over cx square plus d here both functions are independent so solution is let first of all y is equal to ax plus b cx plus d and this will be taken as equation 1 and uh, second function let u is equal to x square plus b c x square plus d and this will be taken as equation 2 now we are to find dy over du when we deal such type of equations which has three variables then the complete function is composition function and uh, when we find the derivative of composition function we deal with chain rule now differentiate equation 1 with respect to x we take derivative both side dy over dx is equal to d over dx into ax plus b over cx plus d. When we take the derivative of such type functions which has numerator and also denominator, then we use quotient rule. Okay, and quotient rule is like as whole square of denominator, denominator as it the derivative of numerator minus numerator as it the derivative of denominator dy over dx is equal to cx plus d whole square cx plus d as it and the derivative of first of all derivative apply on ax then derivative apply on bx when the derivative apply on ax a is a constant and the derivative apply on x the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 then final answer is a okay plus when the derivative apply on b b is a constant and the answer is 0 minus ax plus b as it when the derivative apply on cx c as a constant then derivative apply on x and the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 final answer is c plus when the derivative apply on d d as a constant and answer is 0 now dy over dx is equal to uh, when a multiplied by cx then answer is a c x and similarly when a multiplied by d the answer is plus a d minus when c multiplied by a x the answer is minus a c x minus plus minus when the c multiplied by b answer is minus b c okay and here minus a c x plus a c x cancel out and the final answer c x plus d whole square ad minus bc or differentiate equation 2 with respect to x uh, we de take derivative both side of equation 2 du over dx is equal to d over dx into ax square plus b over cx square plus d this function is uh, same like this function so when we take the derivative we use quotient rule and the statement of quotient rule is the whole square of denominator denominator as it the derivative of nominator minus nominator as it the derivative of denominator okay and the second step is du over dx is equal to cx square plus d whole square cx square plus d as it the derivative of ax square plus b the derivative when the derivative apply on ax square a is a constant then derivative apply on x square and uh, we use here power rule and power will become on start the answer is 2 a x 1 power is less and uh, the derivative of base base is a x, x the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 
and also the derivative of b b is a constant then the derivative of constant is zero minus ax square plus b as it the derivative of cx square c as a constant then derivative of y on x square here we also use power rule power will become on start 2cx 1 power is less 2cx answer and uh, base is x the derivative of x with respect to x is 1 okay when derivative of y on d d is a constant then uh, the derivative of constant function is 0 and second step du over dx is equal to when 2ax multiplied by cx square plus d when 2x multiplied by cx square the answer is 2acx square when 2ax multiplied by d the answer is 2adx minus when 2cx multiplied by ax square the answer is minus 2acx square when 2cx multiplied by b the answer is minus 2bcx here minus 2acx square plus 2acx square cancel out and final answer is next step du over dx is equal to 2adx minus 2bcx this term and over cx square plus d whole square okay here 2x common 2x into ad minus bc over cx square plus d whole square by chain rule dy over du because we find dy over du is equal to dy over dx multiplied by dx over du dy over du is equal to the value of dy over dx is here ad minus bc over cx plus d whole square now we can put here ad minus bc over cx plus d whole square this is the value of dy over dx multiplied by the value of dx over du the reciprocal of uh, du over dx is the value of dx over du this is the reciprocal of this term cx square plus d whole square over 2x into ad minus bc here ad minus bc will be cancel out this term and final solution is dy over du is equal to cx square plus d whole square over 2x into cx plus d whole square this is a final answer and this lecture is completed uh, in next lecture we learn exercise 2.5 okay take care